Hey guys, MD Prepper here with yet another tabletop review of yet another Marbles brand blade. Uh, this one is called the Marbles Camp Cleaver Machete. Um, let me go ahead and start off by saying that this is the most niche uh, used weapon or tool out of the uh, Marbles Machete line. Uh, the other two, the uh, Bowie and the uh, Bolo Camp Machete, as well as the Devil's Tool Shell, uh, have a lot more practical overall uses in a uh, prepper camping situation. But this one was cool. I couldn't stand but get it, along with the other ones at the same time. Uh, just liked it. Thought it was a good looking item. Um, of course, as you can see, this is more of a cleaver uh, with a little bit of edge on it here. A little streamlined. Uh, aerodynamic for the modern age. Uh, of course, the standard marbles. Bright orange enamel coating. Cut out fullers here for strength. Again, another wooden grip. Uh, three rivets plus the uh, lanyard hull. This one is not full tang, though it says so on one of the websites. Uh, again, when I hear full tang, I want it to wrap all the way at the end. This does not. This stops right about there, uh, if you can see that. I'd call that about three quarters tang. Uh, still perfectly durable. Um, could take a beating. Uh, this is more for around the camp, as the name applies. Uh, best thing you can use this for, chopping meat, chopping fruit, veggies. This would do a mean job on a cantaloupe or a watermelon honeydew, something like that. Or, of course, meat. You know, you've killed a hog, you've killed a deer, you need to chop some stuff up. This bad boy would do it. Uh, I've not seen any significant reviews on this on YouTube. I saw one where it looked like the guy took all the enamel coating off of it. If this was the same blade, I'm not even sure. Um, if he did, he took all the orange off it and all that. Um, either way, very lightweight blade, very quick in the hand. Obviously not good for thrusting, anything like that, but uh, as a pure short range little chopper, it will get the job done. Uh, stats on this is a uh, eight and a half inch blade. It is uh, about 15 and a quarter inches overall, so uh, relatively short. And again, just like the rest of the Marbles line, here we go. A very, very nice sheath. Love this sheath, uh, just like the rest of the Marbles line. Uh, we get a little side snap here, just like the Devil Tail Shovel, which of course had two. Just secure the blade in, put that in there real careful, secures in real tight, uh, fits real nice. Again, very heavy Cordura sheath with extra padding on the inside, uh, which the uh, standard cold steel and other cheaper lines like United Cutlery just don't have. Uh, again, your standard little belt loop here at the top, orange marbles labeling there at the top, and uh, another little tiny small compartment up here. Uh, again, for, I guess, water purification tablets, some matches, I don't know, relatively small things there. And just like the rest of the Marbles line, also comes with a sharpener. Uh, which I, of course, not taking out of plastic on this one either. Uh, either way, take it or leave this uh, sharpener. Uh, great blade for $14.99. Uh, probably not as versatile as the other ones. Uh, this one's more of a novelty in my mind compared to the other two, especially the uh, Bolo Machete. If I had to have one, I'd pick the uh, Bolo. But uh, this one's fun. Uh, again, you want to pull this out at camp, you'll be the only cool kid to have one. Uh, only place I've seen these for sale is Smoky Mountain Knife Works. There may be some other places online. If you know about those, please let me know. Uh, but again, about $14.99 for this one, just like the rest of this uh, orange enameled machete line from Marbles. Cool blade. Just very, very cool. Thanks, guys. MD Prepper out.